Hey everyone, how's everyone doing today? I hope all is well. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're a returning subscriber, hey, how you doing? All right, you guys, so this is a different angle. Oh my gosh, I'm kind of enjoying this whole, you know, tripod situation, the one that I got. But anyway, <clears throat> I decided to go ahead and turn things around because I kind of wanted you guys to see that you know, I really don't have a big space for all my stuff, but I converted this walk-in closet situation, hall closet, into like my beauty powder room in a sense of a way. So as you can see, it's very, very tight. So I have all my polish up here, my seasonal racks here, my scarves. Um, I do have a handbag here. I got some art on the walls. And this is the desk shelf <laughs> that I'm currently using to do my nails and then I have like this stand that's right in front of me with some drawers but anyway you guys I just wanted to show you guys the area before we get into this video if you are interested that means you are interested in this bad boy meaning you're looking to possibly purchase one and this is the long shop le pliage in the large so I went ahead and went with orange. As you can see, that was the color of it. Right now, um, this color is not on the website. Unfortunately, it was a seasonal color. I bought this early spring, I wanna say. Um, I think it was early spring or late, early spring or it was late winter. It, this might've been late winter. But either way it goes, this is in the large size with the long handles, meaning the, the shoulder handles. And this is what it looks like. This is the nylon one. This is not the leather one. I know they have like a Le Pliot, no, no, what is it, Longchamp. Um, gosh, what are the word? I can't even remember, but there's different styles. So, like I said, this is the large one, and I use this for every day. Um, and I kind of wanted to do like a what's in my bag because I've never done one of those before. I've always been kind of interested in it. But then at the same time, I'm like, I don't know if anybody's really interested in what I put in my bag and, you know, why I bought this bag and this and that. Okay, so I just want to do it anyway. <laughs> So anyway, you guys, I bought this bag because I was looking for a good tote. And this is a big boy. This is a pretty big boy. Now, would I say that this is a bag for everybody? The large I'm talking about. The large size as far an every, everyday person to wear every day? No. This is a four person that just carries a lot of stuff or it's a work bag or it's a baby bag. You can use it for... I mean, you can use this for travel, anything. But like I said, I use this for my everyday bag because as of right now, I know a lot of people are on this small, tiny bag trend. And you know, I did somewhat get into it, but I just take too much stuff. You know what I mean? Like every now and then, I might wanna have something small with me, but I just take too much for all that. But anyway, you guys, the reason why I bought this bag first is because, um, I wanted something durable and I wanted to give my never fools, which you're not going to be able to see them. Oh, let's see if I can. I wanted to give my never fools up there. They're not even. Some of them are. Y'all, it just looks like a mess in here. I'm sorry. But anyway, I wanted to give the never fools a break from um, just, I guess, somewhat of the abuse <laughs> that I have been giving them to them. So I opt out for this and you guys, this is a great bag. Whether you go for the large, I do have it in another size. I don't even know the color of this. So please somebody down below, tell me the color of this. I bought this one actually off of Marketplace. So yeah, but anyway, this is how they come when you first receive them. Um, they come all, you know, cutesy folded up. And I thought that was so cool how they do that. But anyway, um, just snap the button and open this up. And I think this is the, 
like I said, I bought this off a of marketplace. I think this is the medium size. Quote me if I'm wrong. I think this might be the medium. Um, I bought this from a seller and it has the long, you know, the long straps or whatever, the shoulder straps. So the buttons in the back from when you, uh, when it was folded up and it's like this. So whether you want a smaller one or a big one, it's your choice. There's three sizes. So this is the large, this is the medium, and then there's another size. And then there is like a extra small, like, but I don't think the le the regular original le, pli le pliage goes into like the extra small. Quote me if I'm wrong. I'm new to the brand. But like I said, for the 15 million time, the reason why I bought this, I wanted something durable. And also we're coming into hurricane season here in Virginia. And, you know, Elsa came through. We're still dealing with some of the aftermath here. But um, I needed a, a, a bag that, for one, spring, summer, as orange does. And I wanted also a bag that was waterproof. And this is a nylon bag, so it is definitely um, waterproof. You are not going to have to worry about um, your stuff inside getting soaked. And the reason why I, I can say it actually does work is because, funny story before I get into what's in my bag. My in-laws were here and I had this bag with me on the beach and we weren't paying attention and we were sitting right at the edge and a big huge wave, we were conversating and whatnot to each other and a big huge wave came in and literally knocked us over and everything, everything got wet except for my stuff in my bag. And I am so happy to have this bag. So, all right, you guys, um, I'm gonna show you guys. Um, it has this little pull tab, which is the horse and the guy on there. <clears throat> and it also is embossed right there. You open it up. It has the raw leather right there. So the only thing I can say about this bag, it does this a lot. And when you want to get into it, it's kind of like you have to pull that back like that because it always wants to flip forward because it's always in that position. So yeah, you just pull the tabs. And the zipper is plastic. Um, they're not, it's not brass or metal or anything. And the inside is white, as you can see on this one, not all of them are white it's just this one is white and y'all okay so before i show you this beautiful mess inside my bag y'all remember before y'all remember the days before we knew what an organizer and we put organizers in our bags and all that stuff remember that beautiful mess we had going on this is what the lip pliage is like it kind of makes me want to put an organizer in there but then at the same time i don't want to because I just don't, when I have this bag, I just don't want to be organized. I just want to throw shit in it. You know what I mean? So anyway, this is the beautiful mess that I'm talking about. That is all in my bag. And y'all, I'm going to show you what fits in this bag. And you guys can see, I can obviously fit a lot more. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to pick out, um, take out is my glasses case, my hard case cover. Then I have, I carry this, you guys don't laugh at me, but it's facial spray. And the reason why I carry this, it's so hot here and humid that every now and then when we're out, I just like, shh, or I'll do it to the kids so they can feel like a little bit of a mess. But yeah, yeah, call me what you want. <laughs> Y'all also, I have this in here, which is in, um, I just got this from Bath and Body Works. Um, I did a haul on what I purchased for their semi-annual semi sale. So check out that video. I think it's like right before this or two before this or something like that. But check out my video in here. I have some makeup, which I'm not going to go through. I know a lot of people go through their makeup and all that stuff. But I'm not going to go through that because I just got too much in here. But I will say this. I do have lip liners, liquid lipsticks. Um... I even have perfume in here, which currently um, my favorite is Miss Dior. 
So I have this little tiny bottle in there on the corner. And then what else that is not makeup that's in here? Oh, I have my little um, compact wallet, which is, <laughs> you guys, I feel so bougie when I have this, y'all. It's my first Chanel piece of any, which is just a mirror. So I really like this, y'all. It makes me feel bougie. <laughs> but Lord have mercy, I'm far from bougie. Anyway, I'm just a, a regular old West Coast girl. It's in the South. So anyway, I have this, which is my makeup, which is is a nice size too, as you can see. So yeah, it fits a lot in there. All right, I have this pouch, which this is the pouch that that mirror came in. So it's like a little Chanel bag, um, as you can see. But inside of this, I do have medicine in here. I have my inhaler. I have some... Um, my inhaler, I have some eye drops. I have a little boo-boo kit, which I will go through that. I have a little boo-boo kit. Like I said, my inhaler, um, some medicine, some cough drops if I need it. If I need to um, refresh the breath, I have that. And I have some um, pain meds and I have some allergy meds in here. So this is my like boo-boo kit, medicine, little pouch situation. And that's a nice size too, you guys. Look how chunky that is. That's a nice size. All right, next I have my mini pochette, which this was like, I think honestly, this mini pochette might've been my very first SLG with Louis Vuitton. So as you can see, I have it in the Demir Bean print. What do I have in here? Because I tend to, well, I'm not going to show you what's in there because it's my lady products. <laughs> I forgot. And I also keep toilet spray in here too. <laughs> you never know. TMI, right? Anyway, my mini pochette. And that's why I love these little pouches, you guys, because you guys can put so many different things in there. Anyway, let's move on. Um... I have some random um, wet ones in here. Just some regular wipes. Also have my Ray Dunn, um, what is this called? Hand sanitizer. I'm a dog mom, which my baby just walked in here right now. I really like this thing because I can clip it on anything. And you know, I love this blue too. I really want a purse in this blue isn't that pretty you guys so anyway i can clip it on anything but i can't clip it on this because it's it's just it doesn't go all the way as you can see so i just throw it in the bag because the bag's so dang big okay next i have my round coin purse which I have so much change in here right now. Um, I have so much change in here right now, y'all. Oh my gosh. This thing can get a little heavy for such a little SLG, but I have the round coin purse in here. Then I have two clays, which in the monogram and in the, ooh, got glitter. I don't know. I thought this thing did not, the glitter didn't come um, come off of it, but it. I've seen that it is. I don't know if that's going to be a good idea. I might scratch other things, but this is canvas, so it'll be good. But anyway, I have it in the Demir Bean and in the monogram. In the monogram, I have um, just extra cards, insurance card, my sister, my, not my sister, my my kids military cards in this one and the bean one i have our season passes for the water park and this one i keep that on me don't ask me why i mean obviously if you're gonna go to a water park you know you're gonna go so you put, whatever anyway let's move on i have <laughs> i have a full size bottle of moisturizing body cream I just got this one from Bath and Body Works as well. I love this. Oh, 
This one is the Aromatherapy Essential Oils in the Cedar, Cedarwood and Vanilla. Can you guys see that? Anyway, I love this one. And then <laughs> I have some paper from Dee Dee getting her shots for pre-k i keep that on me because if anything if she was to get a reaction of some sort say for instance i need to take her to the hospital i'm like what kind of shots does she have i'm like oh shoot i can't remember can't remember well i have exactly what they gave her so i i roll with that in my bag for me maybe about a week until i know that she's totally fine <clears throat> like no reaction's gonna happen then I have my wallet. Currently, I am, gosh, all this glitter. Um, currently, I am using the Kirigami in the small size. This is, I have a little bit of cash and, you know, my debit card, driver's license, that kind of stuff in this one. Um, <clears throat> let me put that right there. Um, new item I have is all this glitter. Gosh darn it. Okay, so I have my six ring holder, Gucci holder, and I love this, you guys. If you guys want to review on this, I only had this almost a month coming up on now, and y'all, I just I love it. I got it hot stamp with my initial. Well, this is not my initials, it's I put MYE, my, on it. I love this one better than, I'm going to say it, I love this one better than Louis Vuitton because look at how it comes with this extender part. I'm sorry, that's a game changer because with the Louis Vuitton one that I had, the six ring holder, I could stick this in there and close it, but it was such a tight, tight squeeze. And I'm going to be honest, I'd rather have my clicker on the outside just like this so i just grab it out it's already available i don't have to open anything up until i get in the car and then i can you know crank my car up but yeah i if y'all want to review on this let me know this mm, love this so i have that and one last thing i don't know why i have this random mass that's just floating around in my bag so yeah, that needs to be cleaned. So I'm set to the side. So that's everything. And I've got some glitter down at the bottom of this bag right now. So like I said, I bought this bag um, a couple months ago and it's holding up pretty dang well. This is what it looks like um, with nothing in it. Actually, let me zip it up for you guys so you guys can see and everything so oh. this bag is such a lightweight bag the Louis Vuitton one has a little weight obviously because it's canvas and it does have some leather in it this one does too but this one is so light y'all um I'm gonna move the chair just slightly so that way you guys can see it so this is the bag I'm gonna put it on and yeah so as you can see oh my god my shorts are in my butt sorry y'all <laughs> so anyway yeah so it comes to like my hip area as you can see right here um like i said it is a big bag it is honestly it's like a, it's like a never full honestly um a lot of people i heard complained about the corners wearing on this bag but from what i heard you can take it to longchamp and have them patch it if you do get a hole in it but right now my corners are fine i mean i've got some i've got a little dirt on the bottom if you can see and that's probably when i put the bag on the beach who knows i don't know who knows but um this is it y'all i absolutely love this bag um i'm gonna show you how big it is when i fold it up so let's flatten it, get some of the air out of that. So what you do is there's a pleat in the, in, on the bottom, you fold that over just like that. So the bag is flat, you see? 
and you're gonna bring in the front of the bag, you're gonna bring this inside. Well, first you gotta lift up the flap, okay? Um, you're gonna bring the inside, the sides together. Oh my gosh, okay, let me put my leg up. You're gonna put it together like this. So it's like that, okay? And then just bring the bottom up like that. So, and you just, and then you snap. And there you go. And that's how you can store these bags, which I find so amazing, so great that you can do that with these bags because um, as you guys can see, I don't have any more room. I just don't have any room and I have been storing them in this position up where my um my scarves are and everything but um yeah here is the medium I believe this is a medium y'all quote me if I'm wrong I don't know like I said I bought this from a lady on marketplace because after I got my orange one I was like oh maybe I might need a smaller one you know let's see how the smaller one is so I have used this one this one is black it is a black hole and that's what scares me about this one because I'm like should I put an organizer in this because y'all know how the the um speedies are they're black holes and this is obviously definitely a black hole so I don't know. I might have to. I might have to take out one of the organizers in there and stick it in here. I don't know. But you know what? If you guys want to know, actually, let's put all of this stuff inside of the medium and see how much room we have left. So let's go ahead and put my makeup case back in there. I'm going to put my wallet. I'm not going to put it in any particular order because, like I said, y'all. I don't want to. Sometimes I just don't feel like being organized and yeah. Um, here's my medicine stuff. We're gonna just put that in there. Um, we're gonna put my glasses, case, my mini pochette. Shoot, maybe we should organize this a bit because y'all, it's a hot mess in this bag. Okay, we're gonna put, oh no, I'm gonna start see a scuff mark on my um ring holder um okay so we're gonna put my keys in there we're gonna put the hand sanitizer y'all it's getting full in this thing we're gonna put the wipes off to the side we're gonna put the lotion <laughs> we're gonna put this it's it's hot out here shoot all right the only thing i'm not gonna put in this bag back in this bag is this mask because i don't need it back in there so y'all i'm gonna show you this beautiful mess it is totally filled up. So all of this that I just showed you went into the medium. I believe this is a medium, y'all. But anyway, I'm gonna show you what the medium looks like. We're gonna zip it up, okay. Snap the button, okay. And all of this fit in there, y'all. How great is that? right okay so with this one we're gonna go ahead and do the same thing we're gonna put it up on my shoulder and this one comes right i'm not uh, right above the hip we'll say okay you guys so you can see that i'm sorry that i don't have a lot of room i would be able to go a little further back here we go but it's kind of hard Y'all, I have shorts on. I don't even, I'm not even looking presentable down below, but hey, it's okay. So yeah, this is what she looks like. And all, I can't believe I can fit all of this stuff in here. I don't know, I might just keep my stuff in here and use these, this one for a couple days and give my orange one, even though this is my summer, summer bag for now. Y'all, I bought a, I bought my first Rebecca Mink off. Is it Rebecca Mink off? Rebecca Mink off, right? Yeah, um, bag. It was the backpack. Is it the Julian? You guys know what I'm talking about. Let me know. But I bought the Julian, and if you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys know that I said, oh, this is gonna be my summer backpack. 
let me tell you guys something. The bag is beautiful, beautiful. It's so pretty. It's beautifully crafted, but for my lifestyle, no, no. I couldn't, I mean, it just wasn't functional. It's not because it was a backpack. It was the fact that the zipper, if you guys know the Julian backpack, please follow me on Instagram so you guys can see what that backpack is. It was an olive green. So there was a zipper that came in the front and the opening just wasn't big enough. The bag is big, but the opening just wasn't big enough and I wasn't able to see all my stuff. And, and I don't think there was an organizer to go with that. Like I could stick an organizer. It was just oddly shaped, you know what I'm saying? So it drove me nuts every time I had to go in the bag and my little wallet, Kirigami wallet, was down at the bottom or the back of the bag and I'm searching and it's a black hole inside there. So I was, I gave it about two, was it two or three weeks maybe? I don't know how long, I think maybe at the most three weeks. I gave it a chance and I used the bag. Y'all, when my in-laws came here, I asked my sister-in-law because she has three little boys. And I was like, do you like backpacks? I know your favorite color is green. And I was like, do you want this bag? Because it's just not going to work out for my lifestyle. You know, it just didn't work out. I love the way the bag looks, but it just didn't work out. I need an opening that I can see. Not everything at a glance, but I just needed a bigger opening. You get what I'm saying? Like, I just don't, I mean, I can, I can roll with these maybe because I've had that one for so long and I just know how to work with it. You know what I mean? And I know where all my stuff are and I have an organizer in them. So, I mean, I knew where everything was, but that one, it was just, it was like this, everything on top of each other. But at least with this, I can open all the way up and like, See, you know what I mean that was just a small hole so anyway I just went off on a tangent but you guys this is the Le Pliage in the medium size and this is the Le Pliage in the large and we're gonna do a side by side so I hope look how big yeah this this has to be a medium there's no way this is a small so you guys see how big this one is and then you see how big this is this is definitely a medium um if this helps you guys out let me know if you guys want to know any other details or anything else about these bags please let me know um honestly i want a few more i want to get some short handles and see i want to i want one short handle because they have the top handle short handle ones that has the crossbody. I do want to try that, but I think I want to try it in a small. I don't want to crossbody a medium. This is too big for me, in my opinion, to crossbody this. This thing will be like sticking way out on my hip. I already got hips as it is. I don't need to accentuate them. You know what I mean? But yeah, y'all. So anyway, um, if this helped you guys, please give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you guys have any questions, please put down below. And I hope to see you guys soon.